Hey, that's, that's mine. mine. Okay, let's share. Fine, but we'll go my way. Call me Tali. I'm Coco. Oh, here's the rice. Wait. GMOs are filled with toxic chemicals, they're unhealthy, and they're dangerous to the environment. I get why you'd think that, but studies by researchers like the National Academies of Science, Engineering, and Medicine say otherwise. They pass strict tests for safety, they're cheaper and nutrient-enriched, and they use less resources to grow, which save the environment. Okay, I was wrong. So what are GMOs? Everything living is made up of cells. Most of a nucleus which contains their DNA, it because they borrow DNA from other species. So, how does that make it special? When they borrow DNA from other species, that lets them do things they normally can. For example, making insects glow, or plants like us fight off bugs. Cool! How does that work? DNA in the cell is like a blueprint. It unwinds and the cell reads it to make RNA, which are instructions for the cell to make proteins. Proteins allow us to do a lot of things, whether it's growing or moving. So copying the special DNA means the plant can make the special proteins, which allows them to do special things. But how does the DNA even get there? When you find a species with a cool trait, start by looking at its DNA and finding the part that codes for that trait. Scientists use tools like CRISPR to cut that part of the DNA, then you transfer it to the other species' DNA. Cut that part with CRISPR, paste it with ligase, and now it's a cool plant. Tell me more! Well, if you have a better looking and stronger eggplant sis, you can transfer her whole cool nucleus into your cell and copy all her cool traits. Amazing! But if it's so great, why doesn't everyone do it? Well, Tali, how about I show you Jamor? Welcome to Jamor! Our first innovation in agriculture is the golden rice, enriched in vitamin A for sharp and clear eyes. Cool! Mayor, what's that? Here we use genetically modified bacteria to produce biodegradable plastics from sugar. So, so friendly, friendly to the environment. environment! Also, in our hospital, GMOs are used in research, production of pharmaceutical drugs, and experimental medicine. Unfortunately, GMOs have caused problems like the higher cost for farmers, rise of superbugs, and antibiotic resistance. For now, we are doing our best to control these through proper farming practices and doing more research to constantly approve. Coco, that was quite an adventure! Well, I hope you enjoyed your time here in G Marvel. See you soon, Sally and Coco! Bye! Thank you!